two, one, and go. Jason DeSalvo, Mid-Ohio. You always seem to do pretty well at Mid-Ohio. You put a, a pass on at the end for fourth, and, and that was pretty fantastic. Yeah, things always seem to work out at Mid-Ohio, too. It's, uh, you know, we were not quite sure, at least I wasn't quite sure at the start of that race. I was sitting 10th or 11th thinking, this is not good. And, uh, you know, red flag after red flag, restart after restart, it's uh, just kept getting better. You know, our, we got by Raj and then, uh, you know, just kept working our way up in the grids each time on the starts and finally uh, the last time out got by um, Eric and then Tommy at the end. So it was, uh, it worked out, you know, for, for us anyway. So we were, we were happy about that. I heard you talk to your mechanics at the end of the race and you said, yeah, I just need, all I had to do was stick my wheel in there. Yeah, it was, um, you know, I just got a wheel up on the inside of Tommy and he just, stood her right up there so it was kind of an awkward place to make a pass and um, he gave me the thumbs up after the race so I guess that it was okay with him but you know uh, not to say that I would have felt that I felt bad about passing him or anything no, no. but uh, but you know it was definitely one of the closer passes and um, it was but good sometimes that's all it takes you got to get your yeah. wheel in there and you're there that's it you know sometimes it's just a matter of showing somebody a wheel and they uh, they'll think otherwise than you know it's just like on the freeway. Nobody's going to run into you because they want to because nobody, you know, you know how it is. <laughs> it's good stuff, man. It was good to see you come across and forth. Thank you. It feels good to be back up in the, the top half of the top ten. Preview VIR for us. What's that like for you? I don't know. we got to get through tomorrow first. But, uh, <laughs> but yeah, for VIR, you know, it's, um, it should be good. It's just uh, we haven't tested there this year. So usually we go there and test, but we went to Laguna instead this year. Yeah. But, you know, I always like going to VR as well. I usually run pretty well there. Um, tire choice is probably going to be, you know, real hot and sticky and track will get all greasy and slippery like here. So it's just uh, hope Dunlop bring the good tires, and they got some good tires here this weekend, and more of the same for next weekend. Where are you moving with the bike? Are you pursuing a particular direction in the setup, or no, or? I'm Not so much right now. Uh, we're going to work on some stuff this coming week we have a test in Atlanta before VR so we're pretty busy you know the next yeah. next few weeks but we're gonna try to find a direction because uh, Laguna our test at Laguna was pretty much just trying to get back to basics back to what worked and um, you know we honestly we've been almost a little lost coming through uh, you know Miller and Road America, and we just had a lot of races back to back to back, and uh, just kind of lost our direction a little bit. So yeah, we're, we're definitely going to try to find that in Atlanta and get it and run with it. So. Any news with you for next year? It's all still up in the air because DMD is still up in the air. Everybody, you know, everybody's uh, nobody knows. That's it. Well, hopefully we'll know soon. Hopefully. Good luck tomorrow on the race. Thank you very much.